I don't think there's enough time for me to get all the way through the basket. Um, you know, I knew they were going to clog the paint, so I mean, uh, you know, I took the first shot. You know, it was definitely in my range. I think it was a, a really good shot. And when it left my hands, it looked good. Um, well, up until I seen it bounce out, I thought it was, you know, going to bounce back in, but I mean, uh, I can't hit every game. You know, it would have been a, a kind of a miracle season if something like that were to happen. Um, but I mean, uh, you know, realistically, I mean, you're not going to hit every game winner unless you're, you know, Kobe Bryant. So, I mean, uh, yeah, it was, uh, I think uh, you know, my teammates were happy with the look I got. Um, you know, looking back, you know, we have a, a lot of things to regret, but I mean, personally, I don't regret you know, the, the look I got. The last shot was a great shot. I mean, that's, that was the right play. Chance to win the game. You don't have enough time to get to the basket. This is a tough loss, as they all are at this time of the year, but uh, that's what happens. Somebody gets beat on the last play, and tonight it was us. You know, the Orange have had some surprising early round exits in the big dance over the last decade. This marks the fourth time since 2005 that Cuse has failed to advance past the first weekend. With the loss, Jim Beheim becomes the first coach in tournament history with six losses to double-digit seeds. Certainly not the way C.J. Fair wanted to go out. Here he is with our Janae Coker. C.J. So just seems that Dayton came out strong and just never went away. What was it? Um, I mean, yeah, they, they kind of set the tone early, and, um, you know, we didn't get going until it was kind of too late. Um, you know, I think we won a two possessions short. Um, they got off to a good start, and we was playing catch-up from there. What did the coach tell you guys at halftime? Um, you know, we was we, we played good defense. We um, held them to 20 points, and, um, but on the other end, we, we had 18 points. So um, it was all about getting the offense going and um, trying to um, get space and penetrate the, um, their, their um, defense. Obviously, this isn't the way you wanted to end, but how can you can you sum up your career here at Syracuse? Um, I mean, I, I think I had a pretty successful um, career, you know. Um, I'm pretty fortunate. I made the Final Four last year. Um, you know, that, that was a fun time, but um, every, every year uh, it's been, you know, a fun team, fun year, and, um, you know, I don't regret anything. What did Coach tell you guys after the game? Uh, you know, he's, um, like everyone else, he was pretty upset that we lost, and, um, you know, um, he was just saying how we, you know, we didn't come out ready to play, and, and, and it showed.